Uh, see, I need to play it. Uh, is it the LT first one? There's people say like the first one is just over. incredible. Base, the squadron's a you love the enemy, but I'm a direct hit. They're, it's making a comeback. I think they're working on it, right? The engine's shaky, but I'll be okay if it doesn't overheat. Uh oh. Mayday, Mayday, losing altitude. Commander, you just keep that bird in the air. We're sending someone to pick you up. Over and out. values on these on these parts are really good. Gotcha. Wait, did you not shoot that? I thought you did. peripheral vision though. This thing's right in front of him is tough. Do you do you guys know how many Ape Escape games besides the, the three were on one through three was on PlayStation one? Or is it did it make a move to PS2? I know there was one. There had to be one on PS2. I think Bouncer was developed by Squaresoft Dream Factor, apparently. Oh, okay, Square... Okay. Oh, okay, that's what... Okay. Squaresoft and uh, Square Enix, right? That's the thing Enix and them merged. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter. I don't remember Dream Factor, though. I don't remember that company. I remember he escaped from PS2. Okay. I, I'm, I'm definitely going to give Bouncer a try. If I remember right, it originally didn't get the best reviews when it came out. But a lot of people like it now. behind the big machine gun and then waves of enemies come at you. If you ever played Medal of Honor on PlayStation 1, there's no enemies to be seen anywhere, and as soon as you get in the gun, they just come in droves.
Uh, I shouldn't. He's not. He's not harming anybody. I don't remember this guy. Oh wait, am I? Where's he going? Is he in it? Oh, where are you going? <laughs> you want to talk about eyes far apart? Jeez. Do I kill him? No, I shouldn't kill him. That's not nice. <laughs> These runs, you know, no. the animations are a little bit questionable. have some, what would you call that, ocular <laughs> issues? <laughs> Stormtrooper, I know, that was some bait. I think it seems to be a, a reoccurring theme with when I play these games with guns, it's Stormtrooper aim. It's by the same time. Oh yeah, like, uh, like that, uh, like a pigeon. Right? Wasn't that the movie that we watched recently with Will Smith as a Pigeon? Which was not really that good. Have you ever played Rumble Racing? Rumble Racing, Rumble Racing. Okay, I, I'm gonna be totally wrong on this, but is Rumble Racing, it was like an over-the-top arcade NASCAR one? Is that what that was? Rumble Racing? I, I know the name. Oh, well, to answer your question, I didn't, I didn't play it, but that's the one I'm thinking of. so funky. Yeah. Once you get to the, um, I think it's the next level is like a um, Blade Runner-esque. And then uh, Smudge, I'm going to look it up that Rumble Racing in a second. I think that's the one you're talking about. Uh, over the top arcade racing game. Okay. Yeah, it was an EA racing game that was released in 2001. The wiki says it was influenced by NASCAR Rumble. Okay. Okay. Was it really good? I, re I remember it vaguely. See, all those games, all those, like, over-the-top arcade games hold up as opposed to, like, older simulation racing games.
Maybe we should just focus on streaming uh, this error, since there's so, you know, I'm sure a lot of people are not aware of a lot of the games. Well, I mean, you, me, me as well. Like, <laughs> I watched a video today about, like, PS2, you know, one of those PS2 games you, you've never heard of. And yeah, I never heard of any of them. They all look pretty cool. <laughs> you know, when I when I started doing this, I was thinking I was gonna go. Okay, I'll, I'll do that. I think I'll do that. Then I, when I started this, I was thinking I was gonna go through um, my like PS4, Switch, Xbox One games, and 360, like all the stuff I have physical stuff of, and just go down the list and finally like beat everything. Because I'm I'm the I'm terrible for buying games on sale and then they sit on the shelf for eternity. I'm so bad about it. But yeah, but then there's all these games that I've never played. All the, all the like this generation, there's so many. When I started streaming, I also wanted to do longer games, but so far I've only done retro. Urban Chaos is another good one. Urban Chaos, Urban Chaos. Urban Chaos. That was on, wait, Urban Chaos. Is that the one that has, it's like a beat-em-up, but it has Tekken controls? It was on Xbox, original Xbox. Is that the one? Man, you're like, the games you're pulling out are like bringing back <laughs> old, old memories. There was a game I always wanted to play on this generation that was, uh, I cannot think of the name of it, but you were a taxi. It not, it's not Crazy Taxi, but um, you're a taxi and you have like, you have to get through the level and you have like uh, rams in the front of your taxi and you can like hit a horn that knocks out all the traffic. I can't remember the name of it, but I've always wanted to play that one. Oh yeah, Urban Chaos. Okay, that is the one you're, okay. I never played it. Never. Is that on PS2? Or is it just Xbox? I don't think it's on GameCube. If you recommend that one, I'll try to get it. Uh... My only problem with, uh... Oh shit. With original Xbox games is my, um, all my, I have a, I bought a couple of Xbox original ones, and all of them just, the disk drive has failed. And so, I was able to soft mod them, but just getting Xbox, uh, downloading Xbox games is always on the tougher side. Especially since all the ROM sites, all the big ones have been shut down, like Amy Paradise, and there was one that always did uh, had Xbox ROMs or Xbox ISO, sorry. But I'll try and get a copy of it if, if it's on PS2. I might have it. I because right before all those, I actually I could get I could get a real copy of it for PS2 because my PS2 still works fine. sure the tax game is called, but Urban Chaos is an old action adventure game where you're a police officer who fights crime. Oh, okay, maybe after this level I'm, I'm gonna pull it up and take a look. I, I think I'm, I'm thinking of something else then. It sounds good though. For sending that link, man, I really appreciate it. All right. If, I, if, I, if what I watched is right, it's right in front of me.
Look. Hey! <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Dundee Awards. Ah. <laughs> uh. Hey, look, there's the bees. Okay. And some stormtrooper ring. <gasps> oh no, I did use an office quote. Oh no. Uh. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm I'm one of the few people who who doesn't really care for uh, the office. <laughs> to like 1% of the population and ever, all of my friends love it and yeah so alright making some progress here we go is this one I feel like that's gonna crush me <laughs> Oh no, it's an elevator. Okay, let me see what this... This is really quick. You were talking about earlier, you're supposed to shoot down the UFOs. I think they're up here. Alright. <laughs> this is a very Millennium Falcon. Uh, oh, I'm cool on this one. Gunner ship. Star Wars Racer's Revenge was pretty good too. Racer's Revenge. Oh, that was the um Racer's Revenge. Is that the one that was originally the 64 Dreamcast game? The Pot Racing game? Or that's the sequel to it? Hey. All the games you're mentioning, I like, I vaguely remember. I like, I like it. Went to write, I'll have to go back and write all these down. I always go and search like PS2 games list and I look at the, yeah, it was released 2002. Okay, yeah, I know which one. I, I can see the cover. I, uh, I always, you know, do the wiki page of all like PS2 GameCube game list to see if it's stuff I forgot about. But there's just so much. But yeah, these are all good, uh, good suggestions. Secret base. I remember the uh, the original pop racer. Uh, I never played it on Dreamcast, but I played it on 64, and that thing, like, pushing forward and hitting gas to turn on the turbo, just like, over time, destroyed my analog stick on my 64 controller. <laughs> I mean, nowhere near uh, Mario Party controller destroying, but definitely wasn't good. But yeah, I'm, I'll, I'll see if I can get a copy of the uh, of that game too, the Racer's Revenge. That first one was hard. The original Pod Racer, that was hard. Uh, invisible. 
bastards. Got it. He's gotta get out. Ah! Dude. 